Alright everyone, we're back with another episode of Planet Zoo. I am just currently trying to figure out what to do next. Because we only have, this is part 18, so we only have like two parts left. So for this part and the next part, I'm going to try my best to get this up as high as I can. And it's, oh, we got education right there, that's down. Okay, we're going to fix that. Uh, but I want to add one more, uh, what do you call it? One more big of the animals. And then... We're going, and I'm going to take a break, get the next part done, and then set up the last part, and oh, I'm so excited. I have, I've been wanting to do this for so long. Anyway, alright, so I kind of stopped babbling. So let's go to exhibit trading and see if there are any exhibit animals that we can grab, just as we, just as our last animal, because as much as I would love to get another animal, unless I can find another one on decent price, which I probably could do between this part and the next part. I might be able to find something decent. Well, it's fine. So, what kind of animal do we want as the last animal? There aren't a ton. What's this? Um, for 11 more minutes, but I'm not sure I want one. There's also Goliath frogs. Ooh, their jeans are bad. Oh, golden poison frog. Let's look at the golden poison frog. 29 seconds. Okay, we gotta go quick. A golden frozen, frozen, frozen. Golden poison frog. Let's see. Wow, this is being so slow. I'm not gonna get to that golden frozen. I keep wanting to say pond. Group size, 4 to 11. So we need 4 to 11. I don't think we're going to have... I don't think we have enough. Uh, yeah, I don't think we're going to have enough. Plus, I was in a bit of a rush for that one, so... Nah. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to just... Keep scrolling. You see, there's only three here. I need at least one more. And that one has terrible stats anyway. A uh, Gila Monster. Why don't we get a Gila Monster? Same time, what's the point of getting one of these if it's not going to breed for us? I really only get one per anyway, so... Or do we want a Creepy Spider? A creepy spider, like the kind that, you know, crawl up your leg and make you feel kind of uncomfortable. Um, this one's 1.2 years old. Let's get this one. Okay. Alright, so we're just going to pause this. And I'm going to get a facility for it to live in. We'll have it here. Okay. Um, small animal exhibits. We'll put one on the end. Oh, cool. Oh, I always press the Z by accident. <laughs> I always press the wrong button. So let's have it. And then, paths. Oops, not what I wanted. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just gonna make this thinner. Might be easier to uh, manipulate that way. Alright. Almost there we go. Okay. And then and then and then <laughs> I can't get it. Come on. <laughs> there we go. I go. 
got it. I got it. <laughs> okay, so let's go to our zoo and we're gonna put our animal in here and then we're gonna hire another zoo. Oh, wait. <laughs> to the wrong area. I always go to zoo instead of animal trading, and I need to go to animal trading every single time because that's where the storage is. So they silly me. Wait. Oh. <laughs> I went to the wrong area again. Send to zoo. Alright, cool. So, let's hire a zookeeper for this dude. That's not where the zookeepers are. We don't keep them in animal storage. Could you imagine if we kept our zookeepers in animal storage? How would you explain that to people? What would the media say about that? Oh my gosh, that would be awful. Okay. Keeper. Oh crap, did I just fire the keeper I just hired? Crap. Crap, 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 crap. <laughs> Keeper, keeper, keeper. I clicked. I clicked. There we go. But Eva registered. Okay, so. Play. Okay. Uh, what did I just do? Is she trying to, like, dive or something? What is she doing? Was she looking for something on the ground? <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> Here. Here. <laughs> there we go. Problem is, I think the actual thing is over here, but I'm like, whatever. <laughs> At the point now where it's like, eh. <laughs> Best I can do is I can put it there. Okay. While we're here, we should probably see if we can upgrade everybody. <laughs> so I think me sitting here pressing arrow buttons is probably going to be incredibly boring. I don't mind paying people more money as long as they are doing their jobs properly. So I feel like I should just not... Maybe we'll just go with the keepers, or I, I'll just end that here, because I don't want to sit here spending all my time just, you know, crossing buttons. That's just boring. Okay, so let's see if this guy's okay. Alright, so exhibit. Temperature is nowhere near what we need, so let's go to climate. I just... Like, I just guessed the climate. Go to 30, see if 30 is a deal. Okay, that's probably okay. Keep it to 26. 30 probably too high. Okay, so now let's... In this information... Make no sense if we uh, did the iguana one here, because the iguana and the other one are not anywhere near the way they are. I think they're over there. Part of me wants to make this um, the zoo look nice in this episode. I also need to be spending a little bit more time on like. Okay, so that's it on other stuff, like making sure I don't miss out on any... Oh, my bears had offspring? Cool. So I'm thinking we're going to try to make this area look a little nicer with like trees and shrubbery and stuff. Maybe we can make it look pizzazz. <laughs> I know there's like a fountain and stuff. Alright, so I know I told you guys I was going to do, I'll show you guys this one zoo that I made, and I'm going to do that as a bonus video at the very end of this series, so. It's not completely done, we'll work, I'll only work on it a little bit, and maybe we can, uh, do this. 
It's one of those free for all zoos. So it's not like the kind of zoo where. I'm just gonna try to make this look nicer. It's not the kind of zoo where it's like one of the franchise zoos, it's like sandbox zoo. And my goal was to make things look decently nice, but I don't think I did a very good job, <laughs> if I'm being honest. Are there any fountains? No. So much for my let's make everything nicer. Alright, so let's put this wolf where we need it. Okay. Lag is great. Poor wolves are over here and they're being left out. Uh, okay, we're... This is... Its name is Ontario? That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. I didn't notice that when I bought it. <laughs> I just bought it for the price. I didn't even look at the name. I never look at the name. <laughs> okay. So much for making my plan to make this place look nicer. I mean, I could see if we have trees. Nice trees I can just put in random spots. Oops. Alright, let's see if we have trees that don't look awful. Do we have those cherry blossom trees? Oh, yeah, we do right here. It's not big enough. <laughs> I was expecting something bigger. That's definitely not big enough. Let's try the $80 one. Okay, this is good. So we're gonna try to make this look nicer. Even though I'm probably not gonna do a very good job, but I feel like the only thing I have not cared about this entire video entire series is how this looks. I've never cared about the look, even though when I got more into it before I ended up quitting last time I played, I did start caring more about how it looked. I'm just putting a bunch of cherry blossom trees everywhere. We're here. Oh, we've got some animals maturing. bike. So we've probably got more ostriches. Oh, there we go. Zubira, we, Zubiri, It just looks weird. <laughs> Is there anything over here I can add? Oh. There's also this guy's also matured. Okay. Okay. Hurry up. Come on. Come on. There we go. I wanted to add something over here, even though this is the super crowded area. I'm literally looking, seeing if there's any more. This, this, and my churn! This animal, my churn, my churn, my churn, my churn! <laughs> See, what I would do is I'd put a fountain here, but the fountain I was thinking of using that I used for my sandbox one well, is not available right now, so. I was having a difficult time with this game because it's really freaking out on me. It's getting busier over there. Hey, I'm trying to find something that doesn't look like weird, like some of those things look so weird. Planet Zoo baby sign. Uh, what is this? Uh, Planet Zoo shop. <laughs> I had no idea what that even meant. Signs, random crap, more random crap, okay. So my I want to make this bigger is not gonna better is not gonna happen. What is this? What is this? Why is it locked? Darn it. Okay, that's locked. Okay, so that's not gonna happen. Oh well. Oh. Let's see what else we have here. Uh, drink shops. More drink shops. 
Vet research. Um, more stuff for the lions. Sounds good. Or I really need to get out of this crazy area because it's so laggy. Over here, look over here, people. Look at this. Well, at least it's attracting people to come over here. Have many people come to the terrarium? Because it looks like nobody is going in here. I usually measure that by, like, donation boxes, but I've never put donation boxes by the small areas. And then we have the poor little exhibit animal over here. Alright, so I guess the only other thing we can do is check to see if there's any animals we can buy that don't suck in price. <laughs> oh, what's this? Oh, two babies are stressed. They have places where they can go. So I'm not doing <laughs> Alright, so what do we want to look for? Let's look at the Siberian tiger again. I need more predators in my zoo. And once again, everything is a ridiculous price. Do 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 things will they'll have to climb and I'm not entirely sure I want to do that no, of course if I find out one of these tigers is like a two I'll just be like what male tigers 625 this is so expensive that's a really bad fertility scene that one is not totally sucky So much conservation points. Oops, sorry. Once again, I pressed the wrong button. Alright. The thing is, because this is like part 18, what's the point? <laughs> you know what I mean? And I wouldn't, wouldn't pop them over here anyway. I'd probably put them on the other side of the zoo. Alright, so I'm just gonna keep looking for a new animal. I know some of y'all be all like, Why are you still looking for animals? You're almost done. <laughs> I'm looking for new animals so that I have more people come to my zoo. That's a lot of money for a stupid camel. Why would you spend that much money on a stupid money? Conservation points on a stupid, stupid, stupid camel. <laughs> not that camels are stupid, but you get my point. Camels are not worth that much. Try panda bear. I want a panda bear. Oh, why do you want so much conservation points for a silly panda? I'm sad. Next time I'm sandboxing it, and we're doing whatever the heck we want. And you're gonna do longer parts so that I spend more time playing and... You know. Let's try it around. Unless time's screaming about how much everything costs. Uh, I was like at the beginning, let's just buy what we can afford and what doesn't suck. And then after I was like, whatever. And now I'm back to, I don't want to buy anything that has terrible stats. Okay, no giraffe. Sitting here pressing this button like 10 million times. Um... Okay. Come on. There we go. I don't really want any chimpanzees or gorillas because, like, the the snow leopard, we have to build those, like, things that, so they can climb. And I'm like, no thanks! <laughs> oh, look, a rhino. There's a lot of men, though. I mean, nothing wrong with men or males, but I want males and females because I want some points out of this. <laughs> At this point, what am I supposed to do? Okay, we'll try one more. We'll try the cheetah, because I did want a cheetah. Please don't be sucky point. Please don't be sucky. Please don't be sucky prices. 
Sucky prices. See, I don't mind this. I don't mind that. I don't mind this. If I can find a female for a decent price with this. That's sucky. You know what? We're gonna do cheat up. Mm. Okay. We'll have this male, and then we're gonna find a female. Immunity gene sucks. Longativity also sucks. But let's give this per let's make this person's day. And give this person way too many points. What? What? Who escaped? Who escaped? How they escape? Who escaped? Who escaped? Who escaped and how did they escape? How did you escape? Okay, this is definitely a glitch. This has to be a glitch because this animal was not out before. Now everyone's gonna freak out, even though it was a total flipping glitch. Okay, so we're gonna add our cheetahs, but our cheetahs are gonna go over here for reasons. You'll see, you'll see when it's coming up. Okay, you'll know. Okay, so my thoughts are to put the, hmm, are to have it over here and then we can extend this. So let's, oop, forgot most important thing. Let's put the cheetahs in quarantine. Cheetahs need to be in quarantine. We cannot ignore that. We don't want them all getting sick. And then crap happening. Oops. Oops. So we'll put them in quarantine over here. So it's in all trading. Then, where's the female cheetah I bought? I bought a female cheetah, right? Or did I not actually press buy? <gasps> did I not press buy? I didn't press buy. <gasps> oh, it's only 566. It's only, it's only two. The immunity gene sucks though. So I'm just going to go with this one. Yeah, what about this one? Oh, I thought there was one with the. There we go. Okay, there we go. That would have sucked. Okay. I love how I was like, I'm gonna make this nice, and then I put down four trees and went, I'm done. <laughs> Who does that? <laughs> I don't do that. Apparently, I do that. Okay, animal trading. Animal trading. Animal trading. Wait, I pressed soon. Animal trading. <laughs> Come on, load, load, thank you. So we're gonna move you. And we're gonna move. Come on, there we go. And we're gonna move you. Oh my gosh, did I accidentally send it? Crap, did I accidentally send it to the wolf pen? Okay, no, 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 we're gonna put it in the right spot. Now I'm completely and utterly self-conscious and paranoid about the fact that I could have accidentally sent the other one there too, so I'm just gonna redo the other one too. <laughs> Have you ever done that? When, like, you try to get it to go to quarantine or something, or somewhere else, and then you turn around and it's in the wrong spot? <laughs> Alright, cool. Alright, so now, we'll press play. Actually, first let's check to see. Let's check to see what she does need. Okay, cheetah, 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 cheetah. We only have like a little while longer. We don't have very much longer, so we gotta get this over with. Okay. I know they're lone animals, and there's only supposed to be like two, two males and one female. Great. Two males, one female. They live up to 14 years old. Okay. 
So, what do they need in terms of pen size? So they need 6.6 .6 feet, grade 2. Okay, so we need to can't forget that. We definitely can't forget that. Because uh, those things, I'm pretty sure cheetahs can jump quite high. What's this? One-way glass. Oh! Mm. We'll, we'll do that for this guy. Uh, link. Oh, we've got animals that are going to enter soon. And we know we want this pen big, because cheetahs like lots and lots of space, and if they have babies, they'll need that space. Alright. You guys think this is big enough? I feel like this is a little too small. Just a tiny bit. Come on. No, 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 no. Here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, next. I'm gonna select the whole area. And we're gonna make it. Okay. Is there a thing where I can just select it all? <laughs> Press select all. Super, super tall. I'm not even sure if that's big tall enough. I feel like it is. Okay, so I feel like this is supposed to be... It's one way. I feel like... Oh, but I wanted all of it. Alright, I gotta select it again. <laughs> Come on. They're gonna be done quarantine by the time... There we go. So one way glass means that this way, on this side they can't see, but on this side they can see quite clearly in, which is kind of neat. So barriers, and then, want to add the keeper, Thing and we can put it here and then we want staff path and we'll have it going over here are you kidding me that thing expecting offspring again can it wait until like we're done all right, did I send those cheetahs to the right area? I feel like they've been in, they've been in quarantine for a really long time. Uh, why, why don't I see animals in quarantine? That's not good. But they're apparently... Did they just get put in quarantine now? Where are my cheetahs? Did, are they in here? No, they can't be in there. I definitely put animals in quarantine. Ah! Okay. Apparently my ostriches are maturing too, so... Just waiting for it to load. Come on. Be my friend. Alright, so then we have... This guy's also matured. Wow, ostriches live a long time. Pretty sure these guys have been with me since the beginning and they're not dead. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Who is the child? Which one of you is a child and you didn't tell me? Uh, 
Alright, wrong. Okay, so, you're like 3.9. Come on. You're 2.3 years old, so I'm assuming you're probably a child. At least you were born to these two. It's 2.3, 19.2, so this one needs to be released. That took a little while. Alright. Where the flippin' heck are my cheetahs? Seriously, I bought cheetahs, right? I bought cheetahs. Oh. Are they just getting to quarantine now? The flippin' heck, y'all. Okay. Well, we're not ending this part until this whole cheetah nonsense, nonsense is behind us. So let's add... Okay. Here's what we can do. We're gonna connect these two. I'm making this wider. Yeah, well, they can just wait. No, I didn't want that. <laughs> it's like, ugh. It'll be interesting to see what happens in the, in the final part. Okay. There you go. So if they want to go see the flamingos, they can go see the flamingos. Another plan is to have them see the cheetahs this way too, because I'm not putting a path down there. They're going to have to go this way. Since cheetahs can't climb, this is probably a good idea. I think. Of course, all my ideas aren't always good ideas. Half of them usually are terrible ideas. You want to know why I think they took so them so long to get all the way to quarantine? I bet it has something to do with the fact that there's a lot of bottleneck and a lot of congestion. We have 32, 3,200 guests in this park. Okay. All right. So we're going to just call that done. I'm literally now just waiting for the fucking cheetah. Okay. So while we're waiting, let's go to, um, let's go to habitat and see if we can work on their habitat. What? Who's dying of old age now? Why are they growling at each other? Oh, they're both males. Did I accidentally... Oh crap. <laughs> I had a male already. Okay. Abigail is also old. With this. Oh, and so is this guy. Okay, maybe buying a male was a really bad idea. Okay. Let's press play, and I'm gonna get some females because we need females so badly. And load. <laughs> this is so bad. Alright. Okay, so let's see if we can find male. Female wolf. Okay, so we want a timber wolf. Come on. Do you want to spend nine? Why would I spend 990 when the flippin' animal is about. <sighs> Seriously, that is ridiculous. Okay, we're just gonna buy this one even though its jeans suck. 
But we need a female, so... Pausing it, sorry. It's taking a few minutes to pause. Literally, I'm pressing pause! Move you to quarantine. This point's like, whatever, I don't care. <laughs> Here we go. Hey! Okay. Which facilities are having significant negative effect? Oh, it's because, oh. Okay. <laughs> Panic. Oh, look, we're pretty much at five stars. Ooh. Yay. That makes me happy. Okay, let's continue to work on the cheetah exhibit. Let's hire our zookeeper now. Staff. Keeper. Put you in the middle of... I'm literally clicking and it's not doing anything. Come on! Dude! The flippin' heck! What's the point? Of clicking, Ooh. if clicking doesn't do anything. Mm. Alright, so... On quarantine pass, ready to leave, employment. Staff room. It's a staff room too. Want this... This. There. Okay, our quarantine, they've passed. So let's select all and then shove them over here. Move. Here. Thank you. Just gonna wait. <laughs> How long it takes just for the thing to like freak out. Stop it. I can't see anybody from up here. <laughs> okay, um, so we've got this dude coming running over. He's literally running over going, ah. So we're just gonna, oh, we're gonna go over here and wait. <sighs> I have a feeling we're gonna have to make this place hotter though. All right, let's see what we have. Here. I don't care. I really don't care. I'm <laughs> ostrich is about to mate. Oh. Apparently my my warthog's also matured too, so release you to the wild. And this one too. This one also needs to be and we also need to call the flippin'. Okay, call keeper. Call mechanic. Call mechanic. Because my people are starving. Alright, we're just waiting for our cheetahs to get delivered. Shouldn't be too long. Oh my gosh, dude. Why is everything freaking out on me right now? Ooh. Okay. <laughs> I'm just waiting. Okay, let's fast forward this. I don't need to sit here and just stare at everything. Not that it's going to go too much faster, though. So you can tell it's still freaking out quite a bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, here comes one. I'm sorry about all this lag. I don't know what's going on with it. Apparently you can't handle as many people at once. Oh, and I think that's the other one too. Unless they're the- no, they're not the same. Alright, so let's 
deal with our cheetahs. And then once these guys are settled, we can end this part and we can work on our second to last part. Alright, so we've got a cheetah. Alright, hon. What do you need? Excuse me. Terrain. Apparently we have way more than we need. But what's new? There's always more than we need. Okay, I'm pausing this. Um, Alright, so we don't have enough short grass. We need a lot more short grass. So as usual, I'm just making the brush big. And doing the bare minimum. Okay, so, is that it, literally? All they need now is, oh, they need enrichment stuff, okay. They also need food and water. Okay, so habitat, just waiting. Then we want to filter, species, cheetah. So, food and water, probably a large food tray. I'm going to do it under here so people can't see them, though. They get a bit of hiding spots. And then we'll do water over here. Just waiting for this. There we go. Alright, so now we want enrichment items, if there's any. So let's start with food. So the only thing we have really are blood pumpkins. So we'll do one there. Nope, not there. It's not where I wanted it, thank you. Here. And then there. And then we want toys. So we want a fire hose ball. Maybe we'll put a scent thing. Let's back up a little bit more. Over here. Okay, I think that's good enough. We'll just figure out from the cheetahs if that's good enough. So the only thing we have to do now are the donation boxes and the educational crap. Okay. Oh, you know what I just realized? I bet I'm gonna have to put another power thing up. No. Hello? Oh! Okay! We're good! Okay! We don't need another power thing, so we'll put that there. We'll have a speaker right beside it. And then... Cheetah... Okay! And now all we need are donation boxes. Benches and some, what do you call it? Garbage bins. So one here, here, and then I want one over here. And then we'll see if we have enough space for one all the way down here. Yeah, definitely enough space. All right, so now we need benches. Spread them out pretty far apart. So let's press play while we're working on this so that the cheetahs can get used to their home. So I probably will have a cheetah as a thumbnail video picture if I decide to do that. Oh, my alligator thing is about to have offspring again. Alright, 
see. They're very small cheetahs. Alright, are you good? Do you need any hard shelter? Or are you good with what you have? You're good with what you have. Okay. Alright, guys. I think that's going to be it. Are people going to start coming over here? I hope so. Alright, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys had fun with me. As the leg made us go crazy. And... Uh, we have only two parts left to this playthrough, if I recall correctly. This is part, was part 18. So, I'll see you guys next week for part 19, and I hope you guys had a good week, and thanks for joining me. Bye!